Welcome back everybody. Thank you for watching another video. So as you can see today we're going to have a look at this awesome inflatable air mattress for your SUV by Haytrip. And as always guys if at the ending of the video you want to purchase this air mattress make sure you check out the link in the description below. Alright, so I was in the need for an inflatable mattress on my last trip to the Grand Canyon South Rim and to Overland Expo. We were going to car camp. Now, I don't have an SUV. We decided to rent a Toyota RAV4, and this fit the bill. Now, if you haven't heard of Haytrip, they make excellent gear for weekend campers, and this was a great investment. So what I want to do for you guys today is show you what the overall size of the mattress is and just give you a quick tour around the mattress itself. And the thing that really drew me to this mattress is it's kind of a dual zone system here where you can have a really hard side or a really soft side. Let's have a look what's in the box. In the box, you're going to get this awesome storage sack, a set of nozzles to help you inflate and deflate your mattress. Got a patch kit here and your two-way 12-volt pump. So the nozzle side here is going to be your inflate. You're going to flip it around to help suck out the air here with the deflate. This cable is about 5 feet long. The on and off switch is on this side. And here's a better look at your 12 volt cigarette adapter. Let's have a look at the mattress. And just a quick note on these nozzles. Don't cut this plastic because you're going to have these pieces running all over the place. You can keep it just like this and they stack on top of each other. So don't cut this plastic. One of the first things you're going to notice when you unpack this is that it doesn't smell like chemicals. It doesn't smell like plastic because it's not made out of PVC. This is made out of 600 denier Oxford fabric and it's a lot more puncture resistant than PVC. Another great thing is if you don't like this gray color, it comes in a light gray and a dark gray. All right, what we're looking at here is the valve system to both inflate and deflate your mattress. This is going to be on the top side or the side that's facing your steering wheel. So to inflate your mattress, the first thing you're going to do is tighten this section down. All right, just tighten that up. And once that's snug, you're going to use the smaller nozzle to put in here because there's two. There's this big one and the small one. You're going to use a smaller one. Turn your pump on to inflate. Set to go. When you're done, you're going to close this cap up because if you leave it off, it's going to slowly deflate. And that is how you inflate this mattress. To deflate the mattress, you're just going to unscrew the bottom portion. You're going to hear a huge rush of air go whoosh, and that's great. But there's still going to be air in the mattress, and that's when you're going to use the larger nozzle to stick in here to deflate and suck out the remaining air. And the reason you want to do that is to make it easier to fold so you can store it. Now, there is a caution on the box not to use this mattress in high elevations. Now, Flagstaff is about 7,000 feet above sea level. I didn't have any issues with it, but I can tell you that our potato chip bags were puffing out. So if you're going to get into higher elevations, be careful because there's a risk that you might overinflate the mattress and it may explode on you. All right, what we're looking at here is your slow release valve and it's located on both the left and the right side. And the reason you want to use this is let's say you've inflated your mattress and it's just too firm on your side. You're going to pop this thing open and just press on this button and it's slowly going to let air out so you can get the perfect firmness for you. All right, this is what the mattress looks like on a queen size regular mattress. So I know you can't see it, but at the very top, there's about an eight inch gap, but you can see that the mattress fits fairly easily within a queen size mattress. Now at the top, it's gonna to be about 47 inches, going down from the top all the way to the bottom, it's about 72 inches. And this bottom portion here across this way measures about 35 and a half inches. And when the mattress is inflated all the way, it's about four inches thick. This fit very comfortably in a RAV4. These cutouts are going to go around your wheel wells. So if you have anything larger than a RAV4, it should fit. Here's just a quick look at that slow release valve on the side so you can customize it to your firmness. So you just push that in until you get it to the firmness that you want. Once again, guys, this has been the Hay Trip SUV inflatable air mattress. If you're going to be car camping and you want something that's easy to store away, it's got dual zones so you can customize it to your firmness and is made out of a durable material, this might be the one for you. Well, all right, guys, this is the ending of the video. Remember, if you want to purchase this air mattress, make sure you check out the link in the description below. Thank you for watching. I'll catch you in the next video.